Hi everyone, I hope you are continuing to stay safe. Since our last update, five staff members tested positive for the coronavirus, and three staff members who previously tested positive recovered. Other staff and people we support who we previously reported tested positive are still experiencing symptoms or need to quarantine for longer. We hope that everyone who has been impacted by this virus makes a quick and full recovery. We continue to stress the importance of following preventative measures closely and thoroughly to stop the spread of the virus, particularly as cases rise throughout the state and country. This week, curriculum and materials regarding rights were distributed to residential locations. People discuss different rights, like the rights to date, open their own mail, have privacy, express their beliefs, vote, and more, and if they felt they had those rights. They also discussed the relationship between liberty, dignity, and responsibility, self-advocacy, and if people feel they have the ability to advocate for themselves, and more. Also this week, people enjoyed the first snow of the season, celebrated birthdays, and cast ballots for the 2020 general election. For some, it was their first time voting. Also, Trinity school staff dressed up for trick-or-treating with students. We'd like to highlight a few employment opportunities we have open at Trinity Services. We are hiring for direct support professionals, counselors, clerical staff, behavior analysts, and more. We also have two exciting positions open in the Joliet area for a residential supervisor and a residential associate director. The latter requires a master's degree in social or human services. For more information about our job openings, visit trinityservices.org careers. We also have an exciting announcement to make. Beginning Sunday, November 1st, $125 of any donation of $125 or more made to Trinity Services will be matched through a generous grant from the Coleman Foundation up to a total of $12,500. This matching opportunity will be available through Giving Tuesday, which falls on December 1st this year. All donations benefit the people we support. To make a donation, visit trinityservices.org donate or donate through our Facebook page. We'd also like to once more thank everyone who made our Better Together virtual fundraiser such a success last week. Thank you to our supporters, donors, volunteers, viewers, and silent auction and preferred raffle participants. We are so grateful for your support. We are working on editing a clean version of the live stream presentation and we'll post it on our social media accounts and website in the near future. Thank you for your ongoing support. We will get through this together. Together, we are Trinity Strong. Stay safe, and we'll see you next week.